The American International School of Mozambique in Maputo follows the IB curriculum serving students from early learning through to grade 12. Founded in 1990 with only 46 students, by 2013 the school had reached full capacity at over 500, representing more than 50 nationalities, and was looking to expand to over 750 by 2017. The school purchased two portions of additional land and launched an international design competition for the refurbishment and expansion of the school, including new sports facilities, a cafeteria, classrooms and early learning facilities. After receiving a range of national and international entries, Craft of Architecture won the competition with a holistic design approach that focused on delivering an innovative master plan together with healthy and flexible indoor and outdoor private and communal learning spaces. Our design response rationalised and reorganised the layout of the facilities, adding state-of-the-art, sustainable, healthy learning facilities. The concept sought to build upon the school's already vibrant and dynamic learning environment. The school was reorganised into separate mini-campuses, early learning, junior and senior school, arts and music department, science and maths campus, a cafeteria and two completely new dedicated outdoor sports facilities, gymnasium and swimming pool. The school's old music and drama department was cramped into a single building. Our response was to create a separate freestanding music block consisting of two large flexible performance spaces that could be opened up to an outdoor art space that connected the new building back to the existing drama rooms and art facilities. The outdoor space became a flexible zone that could accommodate art exhibitions, act as audience seating for music performances, informal teaching spaces for small cluster classes or simply outdoor hangout spaces for the kids. Beyond the music facilities, we designed three science and maths buildings in a staggered block plan separated by cool, shaded, outdoor courtyard spaces. The plan was carefully oriented along an east-west axis to maximise on natural daylighting whilst minimising thermal gain during the harshest afternoon sun. The cafeteria was conceived as a central hub of the school, containing a canteen to accommodate 750 kids, teachers' meeting space, a multi-purpose hall, tuck shop and outdoor flexible shaded eating space overlooking a new central green courtyard. The canteen areas are naturally cooled with no air conditioning and the envelope was carefully designed with a large array of solar shading fins on the southwest elevation to allow this facade to be opened up for indoor-outdoor flow between the inside and outside seating areas. With high level openable ventilation windows on the eastern side it keeps the internal spaces feeling cool by utilising natural cross-ventilation and high thermal mass. The sports facilities were split into two zones on the school's newly purchased parcels of land. The junior school multi-purpose playing field is set to the east, whilst the new gymnasium with covered courts and swimming pool are set to the west. The first phase of this build has seen the completion of a simple, lightweight steel roof structure over three full-size basketball courts, together with a 90 by 45 metre grass playing field. For the future, it's planned to implement the second phase of this extension, which will include a 50-metre pool and gymnasium, an early learning preschool campus, as well as support, maintenance and administration facilities.